It is awesome to be back with you on the bike. And today we have a 40 minute hit workout pyramid style. We are gonna get right into this. Make sure you water bottle, towel, start your watch if you wanna use that. Let's get into our form talk and then I'm gonna be able to explain how this workout is going to be set up. Find your seven first though. Riding in the 80s, one, two, one, two. Good, head up, shoulders down, core engaged. Slight bend in your elbow, slight grip on the handlebars. We've got to push here, feet flat. Push and pull, pick it up. Little speed increase here. 20 seconds left. So this ride today, I am going to challenge you to increase your resistance from where you are. So. The goal is to make that six now, your new seven, the seven, the eight, and so on. Slow it back. So that's gonna be the goal for this ride. Now you can choose right now. Every number I call out, you can choose to add one and make that your new number. Or I've also included a few extra pushes here and there. So if you wanna start out with just a few, upping that number, go for it. Or if you wanna go for the whole ride, go for it. But breathing here, back in the 80s, Good, one, two, one, two. We're gonna push again. Right above the beat, come on. So pushing above the beat, getting the heart rate up. Legs, muscles getting warm. Now, this is a pyramid style workout. We have four pyramid circuits. In each circuit, the pyramid will either start slow, get faster and slow back down, or start slower, get faster and slow back down. Breathing, almost there. So that's what you got to look forward to today. Four, three, two, one. Slow it back. Back in the 80s, breathing. Warming up a little bit here because we've got some time before we go. Inverted sprint. So first, pyramid circuit. All right. Yeah, high intensity interval training is the name of the game today. So give it everything you've got. But first off, Inverted sprint, followed by a second position push, followed by an inverted sprint again. That's first circuit. Still have just a little bit of time before we go. So riding here 80s and 90s for that inverted sprint, you're gonna add the resistance. You're gonna make it heavy and you're gonna sprint it out. Making sure you've got the push and the pull on that pedal stroke. And also, I got, I've got some info that I wanna share with you in the cool down because I don't want you to just leave with a sweaty towel and all the feels. I want you to learn along the way. So we're gonna chat in the cool down. Make it in the cool down so we can chat about this. We're getting ready for that first inverted sprint. Breathe. So we're gonna turn it up this time. Challenge that resistance number. Move my body. Up. Let's go. Drop it back down. Slow it back, 80s, 90s. Now, high intensity interval training. Those working sections, you give it everything, then you take it back a little bit. We gotta go up again, we gotta push it. Five, eight, now. Slow it back, but hold eight. 
Might have been the longest inverted sprint ever. World record for inverted sprint right there. We're doing it. We got it out of the way early. That's the good news. All right, now that second position challenge. Jumps and freezes. Anytime you need to take a longer recovery, do so. But again, to get those benefits of HIT, that's increased endurance, increased fat burn, increase your overall strength on the bike. You've got to give it everything. Up, down, up, down. We're gonna go right into the freeze. Up, 10 seconds, down, up, down. When we come up, we hold. Come on, hold. Freeze and cheese. We're here for it. Whew. Come on, sink into it. Halfway. We're giving it everything. We're pushing. Four, two, down. Hold eight. This is one of the challenges where I've already upped the resistance for this whole song for you. So maybe you're at an eight and a half. Maybe you've added just a half from where you usually are. I want you to push. Come on, we're all about making changes. You have to challenge yourself to change. Do not forget that. We're gonna jump this time. Up, down, up. Light on your bars, down. Shoulders over hips, up, down. We're gonna go into the freeze next. Right into that freeze. Bring it up, hold it. Come on, chest is up. Very light on your bars. Think high knees. Right in the 90s here. Good, one, two, one, two. So the pushes last time were in the hundreds. Now we're working in the 90s, bring it down. We're gonna go back to pushing in the hundreds for those inverted sprints. Five, seven. Breathe, dry off, grab a drink. 30 seconds, so this is your recovery, okay? What do I want you to think about with the recovery? Don't completely let yourself recover. But the thing about pain is you want to keep those pushes or the, the rest period still working a bit. So inverted sprint. Shorter ones this time. Don't worry about that. Just under 20 seconds. But we're getting ready to go. Five, eight, take out. Come on, you are unstoppable. <sighs> Breathing. We've got another push. Check your form, elbows tucked in. To maximize this push, really get that pull up motion on your pedal. So that's gonna work the quad, but then the push works the hands and the glutes. Let's go. Can't stop the 
So this next pyramid, we're gonna work speed, we're gonna be on sprint. Climb to the top, climb. So we're gonna slow it back and go heavy. Go back to sprint. So there's our pyramid. Breathing. Slow it back in the 80s, 90s, wherever you need to be. But make sure, seven. Whether this is your old seven or your new seven. Bring it in. Breathing. You still have about 30 seconds. How awesome is this break? Heck yes. Pick it up a little bit. We're picking it up because it's gonna make that sprint easier. That's why. We're pushing it. 15 seconds. Build it here, come on. 10 we go. Whew. Oh, I want this sprint to be out of this world. Reach down. Five, six, go for it. Back up seven. Slow it back. Feel that resistance under your feet. It should feel like quicksand. Like you're stuck, you're pulling up. Go, go, go. You want to feel something. That's gonna protect your knees and it's gonna ensure that you are making the most of your time. Please remember, this is your time when you come. I want you to give it everything for you. No competition with anyone else here. You are the only competition. Just you. Come on. We still have some time here. Pick it up a little bit. I want this little push to be uncomfortable with where we are right now. My facial expressions are saying it, I feel. Twenty seconds now. Come on, push it. You are right in that between that recovery pace you take and that sprint. So right in between there. It's challenging you. You don't want to go this fast, but now we sprint. All right, on to song two of Pyramid Two. Climb, so slow it back. Reach down, eight. Don't forget, make it a little bit heavier. A little bit heavier. 
No turn of the wheel is too insignificant. Even if it's this much. We're going for leaps. That saddle, out to third. Mid 60s. One, two, one, two, out. Three, four, down. Up. And down. Oh yeah. Up. Hold it up. One, two, one, two. From here, we're gonna add one, four, three, two, one, nine. Here we go again. Leaps again. Down. Three. Four. Come on. Up. Two. Four. Down. Up. Down. Make sure your feet are flat. Hold it down now. Hold it down. Feet flat. It's nine. Maybe it's your nine and a half. Maybe it's your old ten. Where are you taking this ride? We're on the bike together, but you're going your way. You're pushing for your goals. Make it count, come on. One, two, one, two. We're gonna get ready for 10. In the saddle, stay in the saddle when we take it. Come on, in the saddle. Now, third. Climb it. Come on, keep going up. Light on your bars, elbows tucked in. Almost there. Four, three, two, one. Oh, find seven. Grab a drink, dry off. Oh my word. So many challenges today in this one. <sighs> Breathe. 10 seconds we go. So get ready. We're gonna find six. I want you to push it. Four, three, two, one. Seven. Turn it up. Come on. You're seven. Maybe that's the new seven. I want you to push. One more tip to make sure you get the most of this sprint. Flat feet. Push and pull. Don't scoop with your toe. That will not give you more power. Hold. Seven. Go. Whoa. Go. Maybe not the beginning. Oh, hey, 
okay. When I'll have more challenges in the ride. <sighs> the, uh, the cues sometimes get like that. So, yeah. Okay. Pyramid three. Did I mention you were amazing? By the way, this is holy maps out right now. We're gonna jump. Hold seven, and then we're gonna turn it up. Right, up. You are in the 90s, by the way, low 90s, upper 80s. Down, up, two, four, almost there. Up, down, two, hold it. Now turn it up, eight. This is where I'm adding in those resistance changes. Listen, this is part of what I'm gonna talk about in the cool down about hitting a plateau. So, in order to knock that plateau and keep climbing, you gotta challenge yourself during your workout. <sighs> Breathing. We're going again. Up four, down four. Light on your bars. Up. Those legs power you up. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. Hold it. Down. One, two, one, two. Good. Again, upper 80s, right around that 90 mark. We've got to add one. Up to nine. I went there. Nine for our last set of jumps. Almost there. Come on, make living. Be what you live for. Up. Give it all you got. I love reading the comments on our sweet seven ride about your goals. That was beautiful. Why don't you be a stronger grandma, a stronger fur mama? We had grandpas in there. We had moms. It was amazing. Being stronger for the people you love. That is awesome. Down. Almost there. That was the pump I needed to get through those jumps at nine. Whew. Down. All right. Find seven. Inverted sprints now. So we are back to pyramid one was inverted, second, inverted. Now we're second, inverted, second. So inverted sprints. Did I miss one? I missed it. Ride it with me then. Let's learn the chorus so we can sing along. Oh yeah. I'm just gonna be awkward. Four, three, two, one. That's a normal pace or whatever you may have been doing. Time to get down to business. <sighs> All right, so seven. We're gonna turn it up. Eight seconds. Build in here. Those inverted sprints at an eight. I want you pushing those 90s even above. Up. Slow it back. Find seven. Your challenge is next. Breathing here. Inverted sprint at a nine. Listen, you are capable of more than you let yourself believe. Believe it now. We're going. Two up, five, now go. Seven. 
seven just for a quick recovery. Oh my. Freeze and hold to like powerful songs. Breathe. So we're covering at seven. And then we're gonna turn it up to eight. And we're gonna hold it eight this whole time. Breathe. Here, four, three, two, one, find eight. Check your form. Light on your bars. We're gonna do freeze and hold. So really, power is through the legs. Bring it up. Light on your bars, shoulders over hips. Sink high knees. Imaginary water is on top of your head. Don't let it spill. Right here. Come on, get in it to win it right now. We are so close. Last song for circuit three. Four, three, two, one. Down, good. One more freeze and hold. And then we're gonna work jogging speed increase. 10 seconds. We go, let's bring it up. Back up. Rest, recovery. Over right here. All in. Hold it. Yes. Feel those quads. You got it. Here it is in four, two, down. Hold eight. If you had to adjust it, down it all along the way. If you can, if you got it, get it back up to eight. We're gonna go right up to a jogging speed increase, come on. High knees, up above that beat. So trying to push. Upper 80s, low 90s. <laughs> Four, three, two, one. Right it here. Hold the eight. One, two, one, two. Low 80s. Catching this recovery. Bringing it back in. If you start to say, I don't think I can do this. You've got to break. You've got to break right now to change it. Cool it down, slow it down just a bit if you need to. Let's stick it out to the end. Oh, we are going. Pyramid four. This is it. Climb, sprint, climb. Start slowing the legs down with the eight. Let's get right on that beat first. And then we're gonna turn it up. One, two, one, two. Good, low mid 60s. We're gonna turn it up to a 10. We're gonna take it out to third. Up to now. Come on, all the way up. One, two. One, two. Almost there. Down in nine. Awesome. I'm gonna be pretty quiet through this one because I just want you to feel the power. I want you to think about what you were born for. Come on. Sometimes we lose sight of that. But we're going for it right now. We're gonna get ready to turn it up to a 10. Stay in the saddle. 10. Never met a match I couldn't handle. No one else could ever hold a candle. Get ready for a battle, cause you long section of 10. Out. Two, third. Come 
come on, hold it. You're gonna take it over that saddle. Really hitting the glutes and the hamstrings. Almost there. Four, three, two, one, back. Right here to the end, you've got 20. Longest 10 of the day, by the way. And you're doing it. Have a seat. Find seven. Oh, yes. Breathe. All right. Two songs remain. We're doing it. We are doing it. Say it now. Say, you've got this. I've got this till the end. I'm telling you what, you can think the cup is half full or half empty. But if that cup is full of rotten milk, it's just a cup of rotten milk. So don't forget that. What you tell yourself makes a huge impact. Spit that nastiness back out. Okay. We got a sprint. Get with it. We go in 20. Come on, push 80, 90. 90s, RPM. We're gonna find six. Eight seconds, build it, come on. This is it for sprint. Four, three, two, one. This is where we recover just a bit. Heart rate still elevated, not totally coming back down because we go again in about 10 seconds. This sprint is just a willy nickel longer. That's just a small amount. Now. Speed over the saddle. 
I love these. Oh my. It pushes you. Oh, so good. You gotta give it. Take it back. Give it everything. Four, three, two. Down. Slow it back. Upper 16. Let me count. Well, one, two, one, two. Ah, uh, two, three. You have less than a minute. Hey, you're racing. You're racing you right now. Get across that finish line with everything you've got. We're gonna take it up to nine or 10. Woo. 10 and speed over. Sign 10. <laughs> 10 seconds. Last push. Four, three, two, one, go. To the end. Back flat core engaged. Two, seven, breathe, breathe, find seven. Amazing. Let's celebrate. Don't skip this part. Your body deserves this. Oh, so much. Come on. We did it. Yes. I love you. <clears throat> All right, so slowing it back in the 70s. Still keeping your form, elbows tucked, head is up. Slowly bringing that heart rate down. That was such a tough, high intensity ride. You've got to do this. All right, I wanted to chat with you at the beginning of the ride because. Like I said, I don't want you to just leave with a sweaty towel and like all the feels right now. I want you to leave with all the happy feelings running through us after that, but I want you to learn something too, because knowledge is going to take you so far in your health and wellness journey. So I just want to tell you why we do these hits, these high intensity interval training workouts. Um, and again, this is my personal this is a snippet of my personal story. After I had my son, my first son, Eli, I gained a lot of weight. I was able to lose 50 pounds. I think we have a picture. So you can see what I look like, 50 pounds heavier from here. Um, but I would go to the gym for hours, get no results. The plateau was there for years. Never was it moving until I start, well, until I started saying, I don't want anyone else but me. This is me, I'm not gonna compare myself to anyone else. This song is called Don't Want Anyone Else. So, don't want anyone else, be you all the way. But also I started incorporating these high intensity rides that we do together and my strength workouts. My dumbbells are usually back here. <laughs> so, that, the combination of those and just some other changes in my, in my life, not even necessarily my diet, I've increased my calories since that time and still was able to lose weight and build muscle. And yeah, so I, the workouts, my, my mind got right, my prayer loss life got right, and I was able to do that. So again, I just wanna share this knowledge with you. These HIT workouts, pushing for HIT helps you burn fat, helps you burn calories, and helps you get stronger. And that's why I love them and I believe they can work for you. But with that said, do not forget, hey, if you wanna be a part of our Discord, that is a private Discord. It's a monthly membership. We have a community chat with like-minded people that you would, they're amazing. It's such an amazing community. We do that and then we do a monthly Zoom where we talk about certain topics in health and wellness. Sometimes we do rides. But anywho, if you wanna join that Discord, you can find a link down in the description to that. Grab your stretch now after this ride and I will see you at that stretch or hopefully I'll chat with you in the Discord. And I love you, have an awesome day.